Thanks for staying tuned into Business Lunch on CNBC TV 18. Now let's move on to CNBC TV 18. Shabani Garat is at the Consumer Electronics Show in Las Vegas and will, while looking for a ride, she stumbled onto a technology in the works which provides an alternate approach to autonomous driving. Let's take a look. Well, imagine this. You hail a car through an app. Your rented car arrives at your doorstep without a driver. Once a car arrives, you manually drive it or let the car drive itself. After completing the trip, you can end the rental in the app, pull over to a safe location to exit the car away from the traffic. There is no need to park the vehicle. Life of dreams, isn't it? Well, at CES, I got to try out something that can soon be a reality. Way, a Berlin-based provider of automotive-grade remote driving, which is teledriving technology, is offering an alternative approach to autonomous driving. Through the company's app, a user can actually hail a cab or a car. A professionally trained teledriver will remotely drive the vehicle to the customer's or your location. After your journey is complete, the teledriver will handle the parking or drive the car to the next customer. Well, Waze technology is built on NVIDIA Drive AGX centralized compute platform running NVIDIA Drive OS operating system for safe AI-defined autonomous vehicles. The technology enables Waze fleet to process large volumes of camera, which is, by the way, on all six sides of this car, and drive it safely. All the information for teledrivers is processed real-time through low-latency video streaming capabilities to provide enhanced surveillance and awareness for all the teledrivers. It's actually teledrivers driving through a simulator, which is what I got to see here at the control center of Way in Las Vegas. Okay, and with that, we're absolutely out of time on this edition of Business Lunch on CNBC TV 18. Thank you so much for tuning in. Up next, Midcap Radar.